Abu, Abu Dhabi. Um, have you, though, given, like, like I said, the, the contract extensions before have often been November. Have you told the club when you will make a decision by, by the end of November or by the end of December to at least so they have time to I plan? said many times, I'm not going to talk about subject. What is going to happen is going to happen. So we are in touch regularly and what is going to happen is going to happen. Always for the benefit for the club. Okay. And just just uh, in terms of the season and the goals, um, obviously Julian Alvarez went in the summer. I think most people accept, you know, can understand the logic there. Huge, a huge fee. The player wanted to go. Do you do you feel though that, you know, with the loss of a player like that, and that you've not had, what we you've not had Phil, you've not had Kevin for periods. That there's just you're just lacking a little bit of the same goal threat you've maybe had in previous seasons. What we lost is the injuries that we have all season. This is the problem. The rest, it's happened. So people came in, came in, came out. The only difference in the previous eight seasons is the amount of injuries that I never had and that we have for different reasons. Sometimes, if you don't understand, is the only reason. So even even with the injuries, you don't feel you were you were maybe just one forward short or without light. injuries. Even without the injuries, no, you feel the, you weren't. We have a a terrible squad. <clears throat> Hi Pep, did um, Lee Carsley contact you about no. Jack or picking Jack? Or no. And are you surprised he's been picked? Which is his decision. He's 70 days, didn't train once. Today was the first training, he trained 20 minutes. So, this is a reality. Hi, Pep. Um, international break, of course, coming up after this weekend. And um, there's a lot of uh, strain, a lot of workload on the players at the moment. And, of course, both national teams and club teams demand a lot from the players, want them to play as much as possible. And you have different interests as well from the club and international level. Do you think at now, at this point in time, that the relationship between the club, uh, club football in general, and the international football is sustainable. Can it go on like this? Always have been like that. And the national teams always play <coughs> this period. So, and I'm, I'm really pleased the players when they fit, when they didn't struggle the last one, two, three weeks, one month, uh, go to national team. I'm more than satisfied. They go represent his own country. They love to play with them. So, but when they don't fit, they don't fit well for the reasons they struggled in the last month. Had the opinion they had to recover. Hi, Pep. Sorry to go back to Jack again. I think Lee Carsley said he's trained for the last two days. Um, do you think that he would be ready to play for England or for the in the audience? in the gym? A few minutes, yeah. Last two days in the gym. If, if he was selected for England, do you think he would be ready? It's a question for the manager from UK, so I'm not involved in that. They can select, so I cannot add anything else. So all I'd say, the day after the Wolves was injured, 70 days out, today was the first training with the team. Can I ask as well about Nathan Ake? He's not in the Netherlands squad. Is he out for tomorrow? Yeah, it's getting better. He's still not fully fit, but he's getting better. I, bet. I know it's obviously, or it can be frustrating when players have been injured but they get called up anyway. And this Grealish situation doesn't seem ideal, but could it help that he, he might get some more training during the international break? He might even get 20 minutes with England that might help you when you come back for City? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. If he will be fit for these 20 minutes, I don't know. I'm saying the manager from UK will know better than me. And how, how has it been? For Grealish this season, because obviously in the pre-season when we were in America talking to him about bouncing back from the Euros and this kind of being a big season for him, it hasn't really uh, started he had yet. A, he had a two or uh, three setbacks yeah. in terms of injuries that could not be yeah. his, uh, you know, his rhythm. This is the only problem. No, that's right what I mean. Well. How is he? Has he? How is it difficult to keep him? Do you have to keep him motivated? How is he? Is he upbeat? Is he? He has to. We have to. But then he has to be fit to play. So, but when we are not. Forget, it's not only Jack. There are many players that happen. So this is the reality. <coughs> and just a question on James McAtee. Do you think, obviously, with the injury situation being so bad at the moment, is he? Are we close to maybe seeing him him start a game? Yes, 
can happen. We don't have much players and can happen. Always when he played, I, I played with a... It's difficult when you don't play much minutes, but the, the rhythm and the, the pace was really, really good. And of course, of course, he's, he's there. Hi, Pep. Uh, maybe this is a stupid question, but if Lee Carsley doesn't contact you, how can he possibly call up one of your players? How does he know he's fit if he's not trained for sort of 60, 17 days? Does he speak to your medical department or is he just guessing? I don't know. The medical department didn't, didn't tell me they spoke. Uh, uh, I don't know. No, I don't know. So I know you're obviously you're very polite and, you know, a gentleman, but surely if no one from England has found out if he should go, is this not a bit... I'm going to say improper of them. Is it is it the right way to to go about it? Selecting they, a player they that they the, don't know if you can. They, have, they can select uh, all the players that they want. So and Jack today train train and they believe they can help us. I'm not the guy who say you cannot go. So all I'd say for my team for tomorrow is not fit. So he cannot play tomorrow. That is only I can say. And after that, since. 70, a little bit, a little bit, two more days and two weeks, and didn't train. And the, the, the people from England believe that uh, he can help them, so go. So, have you spoken to Jack about him being called up? Uh, yeah, and what, what did he say? I want to go to a national team. And are, are you surprised by that, given that he's no. not fit? No. Um, and can I also ask, you said in midweek that your players weren't emotionally stable um, in the game against Sporting. What exactly did you mean by that? And is that a surprise? No, just avoid the penalties that we can see. That's all. It's 2 1. We can come back. We have a penalty in 69 minutes. And uh, for the action, of course, it's a penalty. The Champions League is different. The penalties here in the Premier League would not be given. But in Europe, it's given. So, because the, the way the referees conduct is a little bit different. and. Yeah, we'll improve on that. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.